All right, guys, back here at Locals with Bobby, the Broly man himself. Tell me what you did today. I went uh, 3-1-1. No, 2-1-1 one, one, uh, in our Locals today with uh, Yellow Broly. He got third place. Third Adobe. place, baby. But, yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. So, the new anniversary sport, I'm pretty sure everybody knows what this leader does, but if you don't, Whoo, man, if you guys don't, but anyways, on the Unawakened side, uh, whatever it attacks, take one life, draw one card. Uh, whenever you're at four life or less, untap two of your mana, flip it over. On this side, uh, same thing, auto, he just draws a card when he attacks. At, one of his activate mains is uh, tap one of your opponent's battle cards, switch into rest mode. And the other one is, so it's been eroded, it's uh, take one of your life, choose either this card or one of your yellow Broly cards and switch them to active mode. So that's very important. And you get to risk something for no reason. Right. Yeah. All right, here we go. So here's the new stuff, guys. For Chilai and Lemo, Allied Assailants. For those of you that don't know what it does. Yeah. Um, auto, uh, whenever you whenever you uh, arrival a Broly card um, or arrival a card, it uh, gains a marker. Plus one, top five. Grab any Frieza's Army or, yeah, Frieza's Army card from it and then discard a card. And then plus zero, whenever another card is in battle, take one of your green-yellow uh, cards in your drop area, combo with it. Um, that comes up a lot, and the card is just, it's very lackluster looking at it at first, but whenever you start going into the deck and understand how many targets you have and just how degenerate it can be, uh, it's really good. So green, yellow, green. multicolor. Yep. Um, we play four of the new super combo. Uh, this card right here has been just catching people off guard all day. Uh, zero plus 10k, of course. Uh, whenever you combo with them, with her, um, you choose up to one of your opponent's cards or unison cards. Uh, switch it to rest mode. Oh, sorry, one of your leader cards. One of your opponent's leader cards or unison cards. Switch it to rest mode. And the other effect is if it's on your turn, you get to KO one of your opponent's skillless cards. So, that's really cool. And that, that zero effect on the unison can just let you combo it from drop area for free. Yep. Uh, skills negated. So, next we play four of this pair. Guess the four bearing. This is upstart goblin. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, it helps you with your arrival stuff. Um, combo it, activate battle. Send it away, draw a card. We play three uh, Mecha Frieza for post. Um, card's real good. <laughs> we play four SS Broly All Out Assault. This card is just basically the MVP of the deck. Um, being able to arrival it and tap down your opponent's energy or tap down your opponent's um, other problematic cards and draw a card is just really good. Also, being able to just kill something on command without uh, your opponent knowing. This card literally is the reason why he got me in game one. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, he just kept using this effect with the leader effect, and then he kept tapping me out, basically. Leader effect, including with this effect, just taps your opponent out. You get to draw a card every time. There's another card here that untaps it, but we'll get to that in a second. Um, we played four of the new SS Broly Reckless Pursuit. Uh, arrival for one green or one yellow. Um, green, yellow, arrival. Whenever you uh, arrival this card or it switch to active mode on your turn, uh, take one of your opponent's battle cards for or less, negate its skills. Once per turn, uh, activate main slash battle. Um, switch this card to rest mode and then KO a skillless card on your opponent's side of the field. Next, also this card has swap as well. It's pretty relevant for two, uh, for a green, yellow, and a yellow. Uh, you can swap into this guy. Big dog. Uh, yeah, full power Broly. Um, basically, whenever he comes into the field, he draws a card and he takes one of your opponent's battle cards. He can uh, make it a skillless and activate battle once per turn. Choose one of your opponent's skillless cards and kill it. And he's a double strike uh, blocker. So, next, we have some good cards, good yellow cards. Three, uh, the power of the Super Saiyan. Okay, two Vegeta's Final Flash. These are generic yellow cards. Yeah. And they also help your turn on reposts. Right. Um, we also play three, Encountering the Unknown. So basically, this card right here is just really good. Um, it does, like I said, what the leader does. It restands a Broly and or kills a skillless thing and lets you draw a card. Um, so whenever you, uh, so like if you want to restand the six drop, so like you swing with the six drop, your opponent, like let's say, here's what I did against Trey. He had two active mana. Um, I swung with my six drop. Activate battle, restood the six drop that I swung with, tapped down one of his mana, drew a card, and arrived in another one to completely tap him out. And it hurts whenever you're playing against like a multicolor deck because you can tap out their one blue source so they can use Sins of Being, and that's why he got me again. Yep. Um, but yeah, we uh, tap any of the Broly's. They also get their effects if it's on your turn. This only happens on your turn. 
Um, or you can use it on your opponent's turn and on top of Broly because they're all blockers. Um, okay, next. This card right here, Analaza, uh, fast mana. It's going to be switched to the um, green, yellow Android out of Battle Evolution Booster. It's a. Plus, well, we're going to try both. Basically. basically, I mean, uh, it's a plus 5k, it's a 1 plus 5k, but it reduces the combo cost if you have a yellow leader, which we do, and it just helps you with your arrival stuff, gives you more green yellow. Um, the other green target to go along with the Paragus from earlier, this newfound Power of Sun Gohan is what I played today. The crit was actually pretty good. Yeah, I mean, I like the crit. Um, the main problem when I was playtesting this deck against a lot of the meta decks is some, most of the meta decks like to stall you out, and if they're able to do what they want to do on their turn, and then you can't awaken fast enough, then you're sort of battling uphill from that. That's why you need some type of self-awakening. Some type, yeah. It, it, it's either the double strike green ones or something, but I would, I would recommend just the green ones. Leave the yellow uh, the way it is. Um, free grade 8. Um, this came up quite a bit, being able to draw 2, then awaken and tap in the mana that you use to draw 2. Just really good. Um, next, we have all 1-ups. And so, yeah, here we go. We have a cooler. Um, this card can be searched off of your unison. Well, no, the unison's got to be multicolors. Uh, I, I believe it's only Frieza. It's Frieza Clan. It's multicolors. Most definitely, Frieza Clan. Look at the top five cards at the top of your deck. Added to one green, yellow, multicolor, Frieza Army. Yeah. Frieza Army. Or Frieza Army. Multicolor. No, no, no multicolor. Frieza Army card. Okay, cool. All right. So it only grabs the, uh, Right, right. It only combos. grabs the super combos and the burly cards. My bad, guys. My bad, my bad, my bad. Um, next, we have Bergamo. Yeah. Cold Bloodlust. A bunch of good one-offs. Fighting his fate. <laughs> Champa. And then Heroin's Lineage was a secret rare. But last time you played, you played Kai, right? I played Kai the last time I played it. But, um, if I had Kai, I'd play Kai. Um, there is an argument about playing Cell with this. Um, most of your games are going to be lasting to the turn five, and it's very easy to get there. So, I mean, it's all it's all your preference, whatever you, you choose. You can even play Sin. I mean, there's you can play Sin. You can play any of them. You can play the new. I don't know if you can play the Android one. I don't. You gotta know. have all green, yellow, all yellow energy. All yellow. Yeah. Okay. Well, but yeah, the deck's fun. Lots of fun, guys. Lots of fun. I definitely recommend it. Um, if you guys think of anything different or anything that I'm not seeing, I mean, the only real thing I think you probably want to prefer having a fourth ape. Just draw fourth, ape. Yeah, fourth draw ape. Of course. Switching out the fast mana for the androids to be able to combo better and maybe a fourth power of a super saiyan maybe eh, maybe it's got a lot of negates. Um, I would say I could see you siding it if you need it, but, but anyways, uh, guys. thank you Bobby for showcasing your Broly deck profile as always. Since we don't have a blue Broly coming next, up, we'll look at the red Broly from red set Broly 15. From set 15. That'll be next. That's see you guys next. in the next video. Deuces.